If you'd like to order additional copies of this video or other great videos from the Johnny Carson Collection, now you can simply by going online to johnnycarson.com. This is it, the one and only official premiere website for fans of Johnny Carson and The Tonight Show. At johnnycarson.com, you'll find all your favorites, plus great shopping opportunities, special offers, the history of The Tonight Show, fun facts, punchlines, a backstage pass, and the Johnny Carson e-newsletter. For 30 years, he was the king of late night on TV, and now he's online into the next millennium. Here's Johnny, and a whole lot more. A bush dog. A and, bush uh, dog? She was sent to us from the West Berlin Zoo, and uh, they received her from South America. And they're an endangered species. And can, they you hear, can you hear it? Hunt in packs. Hey, you would talk? You a good girl, huh? You good? Aww. Huh? Oh, she loves people. Huh? A bush dog. They're not too commonly found in zoos. We've raised about 12 of them. <laughs> you want to hold her? Sure, she likes so. you to hold her on her back and rub her belly. Well, so do I. Seven. Look at this, going to sleep. Our bush dog and me one day, going down the trail. Came upon an old bush dog and said, Hey, tail. <laughs> Why do they have. Come on. He was laughing. Listen to him. Come on, Joe. Joe, now take it easy. Dumb name for a hyena anyway. Joe, come on. <laughs> take it easy now. Okay. You see, the whole thing is they're, they're very weird in relation to the, for example, the wolf. But the, uh, yeah, in fact, you can't even tell the difference between male and female until about a year old. And nobody knows why this is. They're just, uh, they're born with the same part. sexual organs. Both have a penis, in fact. Yeah, the, the female has a penis until she's about a year old. Very interesting little bit of trivia. That's, no, that's interesting. <laughs> Must be a, been a reason for that. Uh, yeah, it just falls what off. It is. Uh, <laughs> little question. <laughs> that's a jungle lore question. I, nobody really knows what, what, what the changes that occur, but the, uh, it's a, a Must be kind of depressing when the guy thinks he's a male all that time. Exactly. and then. <laughs> it's a communication device. Let's see if you'll... All the time he thought he was virile, and, uh, you know. It's a communication device. I want to make sure he gets some meat here to eat. If he's hungry, he may not be. But, uh, anyway, I think hyenas are... Well, there goes the Alpo commercial. <laughs> <laughs> he's not... He's more you know, interested he's on than his, us, yeah. His knees. So another thing is strange, you know that? And uh, they also are extremely uh, powerful with their jaws. They eat, they eat bones, frankly. That is a strange-looking yeah, animal. Yeah, sure, yeah. Well, Jim, I thank you for bringing us here tonight. Really, it's fascinating every time you show up with something. Well, this was, by the way, raised by a place in Virginia called the Petapet Farm. And it's, one of, like I say, one of the few tame ones in the United States. Yeah. Uh, Jack, yeah Jack, Look at John. Jack you see Crippen. that? You, you sit you, on their knees. See you, yeah. yeah. Well, if your penis fell off, you'd be on your knees, too. <laughs> I'm 
sorry about that. I ain't got it. <laughs> See? They're also a very sensitive animal. <laughs> Hold it. We, we have two cats, and we wanted to bring them out for a comparison, so we need one of our Siberians. We now have, have had 20 boys. Has he got claws? Oh, yeah. <laughs> This is a tiger. That is one of our Siberians, which is another one of our very rare okay, animals that we right. bred at the park. And Cody is the cougar that was on as a baby with all of his spots. He's just a tiny oh, little yeah. baby with a wolf. And he's grown up. That won't make him angry, will it? <laughs> this one does have to know what a gilding is. <laughs> uh. This is a tarantula. Uh. Why are you doing that? To show you that they're not really as harmful as most people think. <laughs> Come on. There we go. These are not ints. to cry. <laughs> what is that animal doing on my wrist? Well, we're, we're demonstrating how it moves. But I know how it moves. What? <laughs> that is a trick. Most people think. <laughs> how, how poisonous are they? Well, what, is, what is he doing there? Preparing to strike? Uh, Isn't it better if they keep moving? If I you mean, don't, if you don't anger them, normally. Don't they... anger them. <laughs> what am I going to say? You're ugly or something like that? I'm not going to get him angry. How do you get a tarantula angry? Well, <laughs> by blowing on it. I'm not going to blow on it. <laughs> Why would I blow on a tarantula? <laughs> Give me one good reason. Or grabbing it. I or... won't do that either. No, I wouldn't or... blow on it or grab it or do anything. Or I wouldn't poking make... at it. I like him. I wouldn't make him. <laughs> He's a... He's... Whoa, boy. Whoa. Whoa. A little bit older, do they become yeah. a little more, uh, well, adventuresome? Surprisingly enough, a wolf is, in some ways, much more shy than a dog. And I don't really? want to... Yeah, I don't want to... Uh, tell you what happens when you give some wolves a okay. piece of meat. Yeah. All right. Let's see. Come on, little boy. Did we lose one over one there? One of them is over yeah, here. Right uh, here. <laughs> Maybe I could hand you this, and I'll get... Uh, let me go get that other one. Huh? <laughs> He's right back here, Jim. Yeah. Come, Come on, boy. Around. He's exploring. Come on. <laughs> now, watch what happens. If you'll, if you'll bring the uh, piece of meat over here. Wolf here. Patrol. Here <laughs> bring the piece of meat over here, and I'll see if okay. I can. Yeah. Get it right down here. We are. Here. Give it to this one. Here we go. Here we go. There we are. Now, let's see. Now that's that's a raw thing. chicken leg. Now, wait just a minute here. Come on, boy. Come on over. That's all right. That's all right. There you go. Let me get, I think I can hold him there. Right? Hold him. There you go. There you go. Well, <laughs> I'm sure. Just at two and a half months of age. There we go. We'll see. Maybe we better. Now, you better give him one more, if you don't mind. It's just a chicken, con, you know, chicken neck. Fellas, fellas, <laughs> guys, guys, there we smart. Go. Give so, this one one. Yeah, there we go. Here. There you go. So you can get an idea. In other words, they're that no. competitive. These are competitive just like they would. <laughs> We've done, uh, 
we've done several stories Look at on this. I mean, they're, yeah, we're we've, going crazy. We've done several stories on Mutual Omaha's Wild Keys. Yes, <laughs> Here we go. Now take it easy. One of, One of the things you don't want to do is to try to take me to work. I'm not going. Well, I'm gonna try to, that was the last That's thing on my mind right now was to take that away. <laughs> <laughs> to take that you away. See from what I mean, you. right? Now I think I can get these into the. Okay. Back into we? the cage here. All right. Uh, Ed, you want to get the one but, uh, eating the meat over there? <laughs> that is an aardvark, right? Yeah. You will very seldom ever see a thing like this. That either. is a weird-looking animal. It is, yeah. It's the only uh, tame. You don't need to have that angle to the camera, aardvark. Is that, this is... Uh, is this a member of the pig family? No, it's a member of the anteater family, oddly enough. It's really in a family by itself, but it eats termites. Eats, oh, I guess. Eats termites, and uh, it's extremely powerful, as you can see. Is that a male or a female? It's, uh, well, it's very hard to tell, I think. The, well, when the, you're that ugly, it doesn't make any uh, difference. <laughs> These are... Uh, are you a male or female? Who cares? I love you. These are nocturnal. They uh, live in burrows. They breed at night. And, uh, <laughs> they breed... Uh, they breed underground, too. Yeah. It's a different thing altogether. Well, you wouldn't want to uh, see them in the daylight. Uh, let me show you a couple... Uh, listen, he's very powerful. I was... One of the worst times, most dangerous situations I've ever been in was I was chasing an aardvark one night, and I was uh -huh. trying to catch one. Were you, were you lonely, Jim, or what? <laughs> <laughs> it gets lonely in the jungle, folks. <laughs> well, it, it was pretty late at night. <laughs> well, we, but we uh, all have our little hang -ups. We didn't catch it. We... <laughs> We ran into a group of lions instead, but these are like bulldozers, and they actually disappear in the ground faster than you can pull them out. I think you're going to try feel to demonstrate. The, feel the strength they have. Let's walk over to the sandbox over here. And, uh, Has he got a name? Uh, this one, I think, is called after the zoo it was born in, Miss Tacoma. Miss Tacoma? Tacoma? Well, I don't, I don't want to see the runner-up if this I'll is the winner. What, let's see. In case here you can't come. fulfill your duties. Let's see if he'll do some eating here first. Let me give it a little bite to eat, and then we'll take it over to the... Right. What does that look like? A little liver or chopped... Right. Uh... Now, on, uh, on uh, Muster Omaha's Wild Kingdom, we've had quite a few stories about these, mm -hmm. and uh, I think he looks like he's going to take a while eating. Right. right over to the sand pot. <laughs> he will. Uh, oh, right on, hard bark. <laughs> come on. He'll come if you... Come on, pretty face. Give him a good, solid pull. <laughs> Collar's a little luck, Liz. I'll push, and I think we'll see if we can. Wait a minute. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Here we go. All right. There we go. <laughs> That's good. Now, let him, let him see this. I want to show you what he does when he gets in some sand here. Whoa. He should do some. There you go. Now, they are so powerful. What well, the claws? Excuse me. Let, me. let me get that leash off of him. He might get tangled up in this. They're so powerful that they actually can disappear faster than you can catch them. Come on. Still got you tangled up. Even though they're dead. Oh, I see. <laughs> <laughs> no wonder. No wonder you. <laughs> now I just I just found out. Oh. <laughs> well, Not a bit, Jim. <laughs> they really have uh uh, some sharp claws, don't yeah, they? Yeah, they do. They also can bite, but this one is a young one. <laughs> if you will, uh, I'm going to show you. In fact, if you'll bring that tree up there first and put it on the desk. Oh, I see. Okay. Just in case you have to get, get rid of it. Is this, this all right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's perfectly all right. This is a young one. If you'll hold it, I think I can feed it. What? If you'll notice, the sloth's jab is very slow moving. They're extremely slow. You but that's like right. This? Let him just, and let him hug you as if you're his mother. Uh-huh. Put him right up, right up to his, your jacket. By the way, that jacket is not as expensive as the one you had on the other time, is no, it? Oh, you ruined it. You, you ruin a jacket of an yeah, appearance okay. here, Jim, usually. Yeah. <laughs> is he all right? He's, he's all right. He's all right. Just let him hold on to you. That's right. It's Just going right, right through my coat. What? The, You're uh, going right through oh, my coat. Oh, you mean the claws? The claws are going right through the coat to the skin. About that. <laughs> Sorry about that. No, that's all right. He's all right. Rosie, that was happening. All right. Yeah. Have to be kind of quiet here. That is an ugly-looking bird. 
that's about as uh, strange a bird as you'll ever see, in fact. Now, I, I think everybody probably knows what that no. bird is. It's a vulture. Right. It's a vulture, and it's called the lappet faced vulture. It's the largest soaring vulture in Africa. And just take a look at that face, huh? Incredible <laughs> face, right? That's, a, not a, that's not a pretty sight. Yeah, let's take that. Let's see. Here, oh, wait a minute. <laughs> You better take that glove because, uh, mm -hmm. yeah, if you don't mind, yeah, just put that on your left arm, all right? On my left arm. Yeah. Now, Johnny, if you'll come over here. He's eating raw meat. While he's in the mood for feeding, I want you to hold. Oh, you hold that, all right? There we go. Come on. <laughs> Why Marlin's in the home now, lying here. I want to see if he'll come to the fist. I know he will. Put that on your glove. Yeah. Right. Now walk, come over a little closer. Her name, her name is Lightning. Lightning. Right. Walk right on over. Don't be, a, don't be ashamed to walk over. All right. Just hold it higher. Hold your meat. Don't come back. Come what? Back. What, Jim? <laughs> Come to your fist and you just hold your fist steady and high. Hold it like out in front like this. Like this. I come back a bit. What do you mean? This will be the first time. What do you, Jim? Look I here. This will be the first time ever that the vulture's ever flown to. Uh... There you go. <laughs> How you like that? gorilla ever born in captivity. I know it's a drag, isn't it, Jim? Yeah. He weighed six pounds when he was born. Yeah. <laughs> Jim? <laughs> a strong little rascal, isn't he? He really is for his size. He's very strong. Don't really he know likes how you to handle a gorilla. Hair. Yeah, I noticed that. That's, like, that's, like, that's security. Oh, Hi there. Oh. Now, he's four months old now? He's four months old, and it takes them about eight to ten years to reach their full maturity. And his father weighs 400 pounds, and they Good can get heavens. up to 500 pounds. Yeah, all right. So he's going to be a big yeah. boy. Just a little off the top. <laughs> yeah. Are, are you, not, not many gorillas are born in captivity. <laughs> Are they? The first gorilla was born in 1956, and there have been <laughs> there have been two born at the zoo. He's the second one. The first one at our wild animal park, we had one at the zoo eight years ago. And I think a total of 35 born in captivity. Look at that face, would you? He's Didn't really he? quite advanced for his age. Uh, you know, he's very coordinated, yeah. very alert. Uh, some of the other young apes, uh, you know, like the orangutans that we've had on at th this same age aren't as strong or advanced yeah. as he is. Do you have to give him a lot of attention? I mean... Yes, he has attention around the clock. He gets feedings every few hours. Jim he gets Mark. milk and cereal. Got There's you. his milk. He loves it. He likes his milk, but right now he'd rather hold on your hair. <laughs> Jim, Jim, a little milk? Okay, here, here we go. He's hungry. <laughs> Jim. Jim. Yeah, I know. Yeah, that's all right. Affectionate little devil, isn't it? Oh, he's really got a hold of my hair. <laughs> Jim. That's fine. <laughs> They're just all time. arms, aren't they? Huh? First time he's been out of our nursery. Do you think he's scared at all? 
don't think so. I think he just wants to feel secure and he, and yeah. he wants to hold on to you. He, oh. he likes having somebody to care for him, and yeah, at this age, yeah. he would still be with his mother, very close, oh, and she'd yeah. be holding him most of the time. So he, he has to feel secure Look at that, that somebody's face. taking care of him. <laughs> Maybe we better keep you on the floor. <laughs> John, it's a bear of some kind. Yeah, this is a very unusual bear. This is called a sloth bear, and it's from India. And uh, you very seldom see these handled in the United States. By the way, this... Uh... Oh, come on. He's doing the Jane Fonda workout. <laughs> This uh, eats more people in India than tigers do, by the These way. eat people? No, these, this does. It's very aggressive. Well, watch out. <laughs> the duo man there food back here. I think you're going to have to Is that him I me... smell? It, uh, well, it's not me, I guarantee you. It's, uh, it's not me. Uh, if you'll hand the food over here, What's, What food? What food? That, yeah, this... that stuff in the bag. you got to put that in the plate. What? Actually, <laughs> this bear is quite hungry. Well, yeah, no see. kidding. That grass tray, yeah. Give him anything he wants. Right, here, move your... <laughs> oh, over a little bit. There we go. Now watch the way he uses his uh, mouth here. Very unusual. He's snorting it. That's right. He's, he's got a... He has a mouth like a vacuum sweeper. And uh, be careful not to get too close to him while he's eating. He's got a... Boy, he stinks. <laughs> <laughs> Johnny, there are more and more zoos. Yeah, where's, this one, where's this one come from? Well, there are more and more zoos using these in educational programs. Using that. Yeah, put some more in there. <laughs> there don't show in the bag. Put, you know, put that right in there. He stinks and he's messy. <laughs> now, we, I'm going to have to have a little help on this one. Ed? <laughs> I think you'll find... <laughs> this is a first. I think there's a towel. There's some towels around here somewhere. Is there a towel over there? It's a bucket of raw fish. <laughs> you might want to keep this handy. That's a pretty good-looking coat you have there, but... Now, Johnny. Yeah. I've got to open this. This is the most incredible male sea lion that uh -huh. you, I think you've ever seen. Okay. We're not going to do a, a circus act. We're mm -hmm. going to do behaviors. Okay. When I open the door, if you'll just call him out to him, his name is Kaina. 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 Here. Why didn't you tell me the bat's name? <laughs> well, here we are at the zoo. The main thing about a big sea lion like this, he weighs about 500 pounds, you have to act in control. In other words, <laughs> you give him a signal, make it positive. Right. Now, this is the first time I've actually seen this sea lion. I've never <laughs> done this before. Hold it right there. Do I do anything with this? Ready? Row <laughs> Say Very well done. Now, back up, stay. stay. Back up, Johnny. Stay. And Okay, now, throw him a fish. Throw him a fish. Throw him a fish. That's right. Now, watch this. Throw him a little bit more. Do him a little faster like that. You'll see amazing. These have such an incredible catching ability. See that? Uh-huh. All right. There you go. Boy. Do another one. Now, if you'll give me that bucket. What are these? Right? Well, they're just a, just a regular fish. Uh, they're pretty fresh. <laughs> see? 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 Come back here now, Johnny. I'll show you another trick. Stay. What I'm trying to show you is the ability of these... Stay now. The ability of the sea lion, because when they're swimming underwater and fish move by very yeah. rapidly, they have this incredible catching. Now, I'm, I'm going to get his attention. You throw that to him pretty hard now. Will he swallow it? Go ahead. No, no, he's not going to Go ahead and throw it to him. There you go. <laughs> don't get it again. That's right. There you go. Stay now. Stay. Now try it once again. There you go. Let 
Let me try one of these, and I'm gonna. He's got eyelashes. Come on, Joe. There you go. Now go. Whoop. Put, put the meat down where? Put the meat on the desk. Put your arm out. Put your arm. He won't do anything to you. Put my arm out. He won't do a darn thing to you. Well, the meat's there. You want to put it here. here. I don't want. I can't put him on my arm, so I want to show you. Uh, sit still. I mean, stand still. Right. Now, you can take, throw, him, throw him something right. Throw him something here, brother. Throw it up in the air right by. That's all right. Try again. There you go. <laughs> One more. Aren't we about out of meat? Yes, if you tell him to do a cat, sometimes he'll do it. Hello. Howard. Hello. Yes. Did you hear that? He said yes. hello. He, did he said hello. Nice way to start ha, a conversation. Ha, ha. <laughs> <laughs> so he does talk. Where were you during the monologue? <laughs> Well, 23 is good to do, Howard. Howard, do a cat. Howard, do a cat. Do a cat. Do a cat. Do a cat, Howard. Meow. <laughs> I'm talking show business, folks. <laughs> All right, a cat. Uh -huh. Okay, then. <laughs> They like, they have certain things they like to say, and Howard likes to he say. He likes to laugh, that's all. Ha, ha, ha. He likes to say, my name is Howard. My name is Howard. My name is Howard. My name is Howard. That's always kind of freaky, isn't it, when a, a bird or an animal, I guess well, most animals don't say anything, do they? <laughs> usually learn most of the things that they're going to say in their first year, so uh -huh. they learn when they're young. Well, I have to give him a grape for that. Yeah. He loves grapes. They like uh, various types of fruits and... Ha, ha, ha. <laughs> ha, ha, ha. Ha, ha, ha. <laughs> okay. We made Howard made up for last time. He was yes. really nothing last time. He was, he was frightened of the boom. He was just about ready to talk, and when the boom came down, well, he was right. so, so worried I'll... about looking at the boom that he wasn't I'll... thinking about talking. See, I'll put this my my desk microphone. All right, Howard. My name is Howard. Ha, ha, 